All right, let's get real for a second. When you think of military powerhouses, the US-Russia are always at the top of the list. But when it comes to air defense, Russia might actually have the upper hand. Let's break down why. First off, what even is air defense? It's basically a country's shield against incoming threats from the sky. Missiles, jets, drones, you name it. The goal? Detect, track, destroy anything hostile before it can do damage. Now, the United States is famous for its air force and offensive capabilities. Stealth bombers, aircraft carriers, high-tech fighters. But when it comes to defending its own airspace, the US relies mostly on a mix of older systems like the Patriot missile, a network of radars. These are good, but they're mostly designed to protect specific locations. Military bases, important cities, not the entire country. Russia, on the other hand, has built its whole defense strategy around protecting its massive territory, and that means layers upon layers of air defense. The star of the show, S-400, S-500. These are some of the most advanced in the world. They can track dozens of targets at once and shoot down everything from stealth jets to hypersonic missiles. The coverage is insane. Some of these systems can hit targets up to 400 kilometers away. That's like defending an entire state with a single system. But it's not just about the hardware. Russia's approach is different. They use a networked, integrated system. Radars command centers missile batteries, all working together in real time. Russia's flat, open landscape actually makes it easier to set up long-range radars and missile sites. But if you're talking about pure, layered, homeland air defense, Russia's got a system that's tough to beat. Remember, sometimes the best offense is a really, really good defense. And in that department, Russia just might be ahead of the game.